Today we're in the home studio making a terrible electric drum set sound like a professional radio ready drum set. I never thought I would gig or record with an electric drum set. I cringed at the idea, but I've discovered a little trick and I'm gonna show you how you can do it too. I got this Elisis Nitro Mesh drum kit used at Guitar Center online for like a measly 200 bucks. And it's not bad, it's a little small, but it'll do. I already have a Tama acoustic drum set, but my recording space is pretty cramped and I need to have an option that's just easy to plug in and record. Sometimes I don't have the time to put all the mics up and get a great sound. And you may not have the money for a bunch of expensive mics. So this could be a possible solution for you. When I plugged this drum kit in, the stock drum sounds though were, well, you tell me. That's not gonna cut the mustard, Binky. I would never gig with those sounds. Those drum tones do not sound professional to me. There is a solution though. You can take any electric drum set that has a USB output and run it through recording software like Pro Tools and just use the drum set itself as a trigger to trigger professionally recorded drum samples, the stuff you hear on the radio. I run my kit through Pro Tools. It's pretty simple. Plug your drum set into your computer's USB port and turn it on. I actually have to restart my computer after I turn the drum set on or my computer won't recognize it for some reason. But after that, fire up your recording software. So for me, that's Pro Tools. Drum samples are professionally recorded drum sounds that someone else recorded in a multi-million dollar studio. So my sample of choice are Stephen Slate drum samples from stephenslatedrums.com. There are lots of other ones you can pick from, but that's where I go. If you go to stephenslatedrums.com, you'll want to download a program called SSD5, Stephen Slate Drums 5. This program will allow you to map his drum samples onto your cheap electric drum kit. It comes with a couple free kits that sound decent. There's a free version of the software, but I personally bought the whole program and I like to buy the expansion packs. My favorites are Chris Lord Algae drums and David Bendeth drums, both expansion packs. And I'm gonna use the David Bendeth drums to record this little demo here. Back to your recording software. Create a new stereo instrument track. Then go to your plugins and add SSD5. Then choose your preferred drum samples. Double click on them and they will be mapped to your drum kit. Now some of your drums don't load a sound or if you want to change which drum triggers what sound, you can click on the map button. The program is gonna think that your drum set is a keyboard, but nothing's perfect. You can figure it out. And now the magic begins. Yeah, it's not quite the same as recording an acoustic kit, but the hits are dynamic. Most people are already hearing these exact drum sounds on the radio. Maybe not the cymbals, but they're pretty darn convincing. This might be a great solution for you if you have a small space, you lack equipment, or you live in an apartment even. Plus, if you don't like the drum set that you picked, you can actually change the drum sounds later. Or if you made a bad drum fill, you can actually change the drum fill with just a few clicks. Every time you hit a note, it registers in your recording software as a MIDI note instead of a wave. So you can actually go to the MIDI editor and change whatever you want. Not too shabby. To use this setup live, you'll want a laptop and a USB recording interface. I use a small PreSonus interface. Then you can use a couple of the outputs to run a stereo mix of your drums to the soundboard. If you want to buy this electric drum set or Stephen Slate Drums, the program, check the links in the video description. I'm still not going to sell my Tama acoustic drum set anytime soon, but this Elisis does just fine for a lot of projects. And I would even gig with it. In fact, 
you might get a better kick drum that way. If the venue has good subs, you really cannot beat a sampled kick drum sound. Hope you found this helpful. Let me know if these drum sounds surprised you at all, because I was blown away at how far electric drum technology has actually come. So if you have any questions, uh, put them in the comments and I'll try to answer them the best I can. Now go take over the musical universe.